Yo, what's up guys? I'm waiting for my daughter to get out of her gymnastics Christmas party. She's having a good old time in there. We brought the waters and the Rice Krispie treats. So I'm just waiting for that. And I started thinking about this little story here. Whenever you're hiring someone to work for you or your band, make sure you vet them. We hired this radio guy back in 2013 and he's a really nice guy but I think he was like at the end of his, you know, time in, in the industry. He'd been in it for a couple of decades. And so we hired him and he started working the single to different stations around the country. And he seemed pretty stoked, you know, cause you want someone to be excited about your music and the thing that they're pushing. So one of the things you do in lieu of money, like paying a radio station to play your song, that's called payola and it's illegal. You basically like do favors in exchange for radio play. And it was never guaranteed that they were gonna add you or anything like that, but you go do these shows in hopes that maybe that you would get some airplay in return. So he set us up with this gig in Lincoln, Nebraska, which was like his hometown or something. Or maybe you went to school there maybe. And he's like, yeah, we're gonna put you there with the radio station and it'll, it'll be cool and you know. So we would, we would do this a lot in those days, this is like 10 years ago, when radio was still pretty powerful. And we, ended, we did get um, major rotation from doing this kind of stuff on major stations around the country, which was great. And it helped a lot, it helped the shows in that area for sure. So we go do this thing and mind you, it was 1500 miles from home. We live on the East Coast, we live in Maryland. And we did this show out in Lincoln, Nebraska and we get there and it's like this, like a generic, like Buffalo Wild Wings is like an independently owned Buffalo Wild Wings type of place. And we played this set outside in the parking lot. Luckily there was production because there was no radio station. There was no radio station attached. And the whole premise was to go out there and play this radio show for the station and then in hopes of getting some airplay in return, if not even in a full ad. So yeah, there was no radio station. And I remember like maybe a hundred people showed up or something like that, because we were doing okay in Lincoln, Nebraska at that time. We were bringing people out. We drove all the way out there, did one show, 1500 miles there, 1500 miles back. So do the math, I'll help, it's 3000 miles. And you know, we just treated it as a regular show. We just rocked out like normal. We, we would play the show like if there were a thousand people there, you know, but there was no radio station. And the guy didn't show up either. A lot of times you'll get these guys, they'll they'll shop to the stations they'll, and then they'll coordinate these shows where you get on get on the show. Then they'll show up, they'll rub elbows, they'll, they'll schmooze, you know, butter them up and you do everything you can to build the relationship and hope that you get to play. Yeah, he wasn't there either. So went out and did this show, played, probably sold a little bit of merch, but that was it. I'm pretty certain that we didn't get paid either. It was a free thing. So yeah, just make sure you vet the people that you're dealing with and probably vet the show and make sure the town actually has a radio station when it comes to the radio stuff. Yeah, that's my story. Uh, if you like this kind of content, let me know, like just telling stories, um, hoping to share some lessons from these stories, you know, if not some entertainment just to make you laugh, hit that subscribe button, smash the like button and ring the bell so you don't want to go live. I go live every Wednesday night when I'm not on tour. We sing songs, hang out, and I'm also over on kick pretty much every morning during the week, uh, just drinking coffee and hanging out and bullshitting. So, all right. Happy holidays.